songs, wake songs, all these songs, they're all, they're all different times and different areas of singing, you know, but uh, uh, singing bird songs, they're different joyful songs, happy songs, spiritual songs. that's how we sing them, we sing them at all kinds of gatherings, weddings, whatever, in you know, a powwows, whatever, or gatherings we have all over, that's, these, these songs are happy songs, they're joyful songs, they're spiritual songs. What would, what would you want the public to learn about the people? What's the main thing you want them to know about us? That we're still here. We're still here representing our ancestors, what they taught us, and, and expose it to the public now that we get exposed to the public now that because of the powwow. So if they want to know us, we want to expose our songs to the people. We hoop and holler, jump up and down, and have a good time, you know? Amen, and that's, that's what we do. We don't just go over there and sing real mean, real hard. We sing because we're bringing the glory of, of our culture out to the people. I had young singers that sang with me before, and they'd ask me, they'd ask me, what are we singing about? And I'd tell them about the song that we're singing about. I'd tell them what it means. Because the songs that we sing are sto stories of our migrations. When we moved with the change of the weather, when it got too hot in our area, we'd try to find a, a, a cooler place to live. The head man used to see things and he'd sing a song or make a poem or something like this and then and it just went on and as he came back we made songs about it this and this is the way we kept our our story in history you want to preserve what's good the good things and this is a good thing but as long as we can you know keep this going uh, then our kids as kids will will be able to hear it you know maybe they won't be full-blood Indian but they know that their ancestors this is from their ancestors and it's something to be proud of to still have um, um, Cruz. Uh, he used to run this part for us too, and, and also the power. So he's not here with us no more, but he's still here. And uh, and uh, Tommy, Tommy Ramos, and like I said, James usually here, but he's probably in Hawaii or somewhere. I don't know where he's at. So, the way we honor him is singing his songs, and keep him going. That's what he wanted. He wanted everybody to sing together and everybody to dance and feel good and be happy. That's what his songs are about. So let's do that for the last song.